So, The Item is a movie I've never heard of. The only reason I found out about this was from a review of Axum, saying that they were going to be surprised if Axum was going to be truly more terrible than The Item. And he concluded that The Item is still the worst movie he's seen. And that got me wondering, can there truly be a movie more awful than Axum? And yeah, it's bad. Think of this movie as if an incel decided to make a movie wings, and bitch. tries to make himself as cool as possible. <laughs> so with Axum, they had the problem of being a bit too lazy. But this movie, it's more like they were way too ambitious. And honestly, they made a pretty damn good movie. <laughs> The opening scene is a guy making some dolls. You know, the usual blow torching the head, covering it in barbed wire. I don't know anything about making dolls, so I'll trust this. Four Come people are in a car, and things are starting to get tense monkey, because Alex. this guy was promised a monkey. I want the monkey. monkey, Alex. You promised us a monkey? Where's the fucking monkey? I don't know where the goddamn monkey is. Some guy comes. Oh, her hair is in the way. Okay, good. She pushed it back during that cutaway. Basically, this guy is a doctor with a live specimen inside of the box. They have to do a bunch of science shit in order to keep it alive. Also, why did they add a pool? Okay. It was not needed at all. I'm Even the doctor exactly doesn't sure know what's inside the blob. The blob in the box, as you call it, is. Only lately have I come to realize it's not what the blob is that seems to be important, but why the blob is seems to truly matter. What? Also, what does, what does this mean? I like looking at the night sky. It looks the same upside down as it does right side up. What is this script? Are you They're trying too hard to make you know, Doc, look all No, Doc, I'm starting cool. to realize that it's not who we are that's relevant, but why we are that really seems to matter. I see. Just think of this as the little troop of goblins you encountered one night in the desert. What is a troop of goblins? The doctor changes his mind last minute and tries to confront them. Then dies. When they kill him, his daughter, I'm not exactly sure who that is, comes running at them with a tiny knife. But little do they know that she's a Terminator, and she's getting shot to oblivion. Holy shit, dude. She makes it all the way, but runs past them for some reason. And after that whole fiasco, they go to Lorita's house, who is Alex's girlfriend and an artist, who likes to do stuff with dolls. That's her artist's creed. Still better than Damien Hirst. <clears throat> oh Jesus, that scared me. I, I was not expecting that. Okay, why are they so close up now? They don't need to be this close for them to talk to each other. The cameraman is like literally up in their faces. They decide to open the box to get a better look at what's inside, and some are reluctant about opening it. The until this guy it's says, more like tugging Jesus and baby Jesus' nose hairs. What? Well, in that case, you just look dangerous. And what's inside? Well, it's a. Uh... Now that's different. From the looks of it so far, it's kind of sus, not gonna lie. They don't show it all. Oh, gross! Oh, my Bro, what the fuck? Lorita's friends come in, and Alex acts as if he's never seen a woman. But because they saw the box, they need to die, so they levitate after them. But one of them was Kung Fu. Then an earthquake happens as they're getting shot. I have had it! You are putting down that goddamn camera! They Dead. negotiate a deal. Thomas, you will kill me! Yes, I promise. What? 
Why did it freeze frame there? Negotiations fail, then a stormtrooper fight commences. And these guys are elusive. What the hell is this fight? I don't even know what's going on. He kills the girl and kisses her. Well, at least he's not anti-LGBTQ+. The creature in the box starts moving, and out comes a penis alien. They don't know what to do with it and put it in a bucket. Just sort of leaving it there while he, they go off doing other stuff. You know, just not giving a fuck about the penis alien. It gets really boring for a while. All you need to know is that he has brain cancer and he is a psychopath. Then feeds the alien semen because obviously cool guys have sex. Fatty here. I'm sorry, but that's what Alex keeps calling him. I have not heard his name at all so far. Because, you know, cool guys are dicks to their friends. Gets bullied because he wasn't holding his gun. Then when he leaves, the alien starts talking. Don't you hate waking up in the middle of the night with a partially full of stuff to your face? What? Fatty starts having Fuck a mental them. breakdown Fuck after them. talking to the alien Fuck about you. being so fat. Fuck them! Fuck them! Oh my god, it looks so small. Fuck them! Fuck them! Fuck them! Stretch mark like a pregnant fucking woman. Also, what does the actor think when he has to say these lines? Me, daddy. Patty the fat pig. He just eats and eats. He's a fat fucking pig. Who could fuck this? No one. 30? He's not getting like getting paid a lot for grand? this, is he? I'm getting a thousand. Wait, you guys are getting paid? He can't oh take it anymore and then starts blasting. Then gets knocked out. Alex apologizes to Fatty. She never stuck the gun in your face. Damn it, why do I do shit like that? Talking out their problems until Alex just decides to be a dick and shoots him. At least call him by his name once. All I remember him as is Fatty. No! My name's not Fatty. Now his group is obviously now scared of him. So, to rectify this, he decides to do this. Wow, it didn't work. Then the alien goes after Mustache Man. Mustache gets pretty messed up visions that are actually pretty damn gruesome. I'm sorry, but they never say a name other than Alex who is currently cutting up Fatty's body. Also, one of Loretta's friends from the beginning survived, thinking that now's his chance to get away while the Alex is cutting up the body next to the car he's trying to get away in. Yeah, not the, not the smartest guy in the world. Mustache runs away from the alien to meet Alex with the guy he caught while he, this funky music is playing. Lauren, get her away from the fucking kid! Ah, so that's her name. Alex and Show Mustache have a big fight where Alex finally gets his ass whooped. Alex grabs Mustache's gun, pulling it on himself, then... Now pull the trigger. Martin, don't you fucking dare! Oh, his name is Marty. Gets manipulated by Alex into killing the guy. Then the guy uses an Uno reverse, and Marty now wants to kill Alex. Then gets shot by the kid. I don't know why he thought it was a good idea to kill the guy who's about to help him. Then, the gun conveniently has no bullets as he's about to kill Alex. Killing the kid with a matrix curved bullet. Cause you know, cool guys don't shoot bullets in straight lines. Lorene is it's currently like having a life. therapy session with the penis alien. Not good. No. Coming back to a bloody mess. Talking to Alex, being an intermediary for their fight. Ask Alex if he's going to kill me. 
Florida absolutely destroying him by saying that she'd literally be dead then go out with him. We're joining the flu people on my floor. I think I prefer the floor. Thankfully, well, he's yeah. the one that's not dead. Finally, he was such a dick. I hated him. Not only that, but he's got diarrhea too. Oh. Oh, there he goes. Loreen leaves while the Lorita just goes to sleep while the penis alien is still in her house. Oh, and the dead bodies too. Then she decides to fuck the alien. And that's how it ends. She just decides to leave with it. Cue gunshot. I just realized that instead of going out with Alex, she decides it's better to be with a penis alien than him. Which honestly, I would too. The penis Get alien gives good advice. Night, squatting on the floor naked in front of the refrigerator just eating and eating and eating until your dick gets too cold or your legs ache from grouchy like an ape. And Alex is just a dick. Holy shit. That's what this movie is trying to tell me. Actual dicks might be better than people who are dicks.